M0FXP, welcome to my channel. Zygu G90, and then we've got my Android phone, which is a Galaxy 21, I believe. And we're running FT8, which is receiving here. Now, this is a free APK that you can download. I'll put a link in the description. We'll look like this and scroll down a bit. Download this APK. There's always updates happening here. And just Google it and you'll find it will come up straight away. Download that to your Android phone. Okay, and then once you've done that, you do need to connect your cable. So the cable on the G90 is the standard one that comes in the box. Bottom, it's the bottom pin. Okay. And plug it in. You need an adapter. This is a proper Samsung one that goes USB to USB. Not all adapters will work. Try them out. Um, first thing I suppose is go to settings. So we look at settings here now. At the moment, I'm not getting any TX audio coming out of the ray of my device, but I'm still going to show you it anyway. So, call sign grid is transmitting. You know, it's controlling the radio, but there's no no FT8 is coming out. If that makes sense. So we've got the frequency 7074. I'll show you that that how that changes soon. I've selected cat. And connection type USB. CIV is 70. I didn't change that. Maybe that's my problem. But board rate 192. Keep going up. Uh, that's it. Nothing else really. Audio output. So maybe I've got something set wrong. Back out. And it starts as soon as it's, you know you connect. It started to receive very quickly, and it actually started transmitting very quickly. I'm not really sure why, because I didn't set that. But anyway, you can see it's transmitting. You just tap that there, and you can do double tap different. Like it keeps calling the same one there. You can double tap on the screen. It will change to a different station to try and transmit to. But they're never going to hear me. Uh, so what else have we got here? We've got a map. Pretty cool. That's how you can adjust your signal output strength. Keep an eye on your ALC. You want to set the meter to ALC on your device. Keep that. You don't want that too high, basically. Frequency watch. We'll just let it change. There you are. It just changed then. Let's do that again. Let's go to 20 and it's changed. So it's controlling the radio. It's possible you need additional audio interface, you know, to um, to transmit audio. I don't know because I, I just found this by chance. I was just testing something else actually. I was testing Pocket RX TX and then this app just fired up because it was already on my phone. So let's set the frequency. It's set the USB data. Let's go back here. What else can we find? I mean, it's pretty cool just watching it in receive, to be honest. It's definitely still transmitting. That's how you get this come out. Let's see if we come out of this window. You even get the call signs here when it's coming through. The idea is that you double tap. Now, I think you can clear this log. Let's just double tap a different one. Double tap, and it starts the TX. The new one. So give it a go. There's the cable, the blue sort of cable that comes in the box with the radio. And you can buy them used for about, I think they're about £6 from AliExpress. Good luck with it. Bye for now. 7-3, all the best.